Hey, what's your sign? My name is Peter Bedard, and this is Create Your Health, and we're going to be sitting down with Stephanie Jones, who is a fantastic astrologer, who's going to read my chart. Here we go. <laughs> Astrology is the map of the stars when you were born. And those stars, planets actually, are symbolic representatives of the energy that you were born with. The day you were born, your soul chose to incarnate on that day because the energy of your constitution and your, your, your divine self matched what was happening with the planets on that day the sun shows where our ego is, our strength, our ambition. The moon is our emotions, our sensitivity and feeling. Mercury is the mind. Venus is art. Mars is, is aggression. There's the position where the planets were when you were born. They also move a degree per year. They also move monthly. And they also move daily. So I like to say it's like the face of a clock, the hour hand, the minute hand, and the second hand. And when you look at your chart, you're interpreting and you're synthesizing and you're, and you're integrating all of that different harmonic energy. And you're coming up with a picture that constantly shifts and changes based on your understanding of that picture. So understanding it, you then can start to move with it and, and work with it. Why people come to me is to have their energy enlightened and shifted. They come to me to have someone look directly at them and tell them what they're doing, why they're, why they're here. It's kind of like looking in the mirror. If you never see your own reflection, you don't know what you look like. What I love so much about it is that it helps you see life as energy and, and as a vital moving, living concept that you can then cooperate with. It, frees you from feeling as though you're a victim. What does all this mean? So it's a whole language and the and the vocabulary of the language <clears throat> or the words of the language are the planets. If Mars is in Aries, that's his sign. He's very empowered. He's free. He's clear. He's, he's right there to do his thing. If he's in Pisces, he's a little bit more weakened, he's debilitated. So the planets each go through the sign and this is a different way in which they express their energy and then there's a circle around the earth, an imaginary circle around the earth is drawn and we divide it into 12 sections and each of those sections is called a house. And so that's what each and of these little what pie these, pieces are. These pie pieces are houses and those are different areas of life. We see where the planets are in what sign and what house and that shows the characteristic tendencies you were born with. I'm going to give you a little insight into who you are, what I see in your astrology based on what I see in the chart. And all I got from you, I've never met you before in my life, but what I did get from you is your birth date, your birth time, and your birth place. We see that you're Aquarius, you're an Aquarius, which means the sun was in Aquarius when you were born. And you were born around sunrise, which means that Aquarius was coming up on the horizon, the sign of Aquarius was coming up on the horizon. And you have Mercury, Venus, and Saturn in Pisces, all in the first house. So what this is, is that you are very much involved in self-discovery in this lifetime. You're very compassionate, and at the same time, you're very psychic, very much a healer, and also you're involved and interested in technology. But at the same time, you're very traditional. You have the moon in Capricorn. Part of what you're drawn to do is create partnership, to create relationship, to create companionship, to create connection. You're a connector. You're like connecting tissue. And you, and you create a big, huge family of people in your work. I have to time. stop for a moment yeah. because I, I have my family here. There's people here and they're all laughing right now. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> so my little group of people that is, you know, helping to make this happen is here and they're all giggling. So you've got to be hitting something. Thank you so much. I mean, I, I, uh, wow. I, this stuff always seems so out there and mystical to me. And you really helped ground it into 
my life mm. into actually understanding and comprehending mm-hmm. what all of that means. And I so appreciate that. I'm going to have to come back and get like get this whole thing read because we only had time to look at a few little things. Yep. I, I want to figure that out because you nailed me. That was awesome. <laughs> Thank Seriously. you. Seriously, <laughs> thank you so much. And thank you for tuning in to Create Your Health. Take what you like, leave the rest, and create your health. <laughs> Have a great day. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, that was really, that was really fun. cool. Hey, thanks for watching this episode of Create Your Health. Be sure to go to our website where you can watch another episode, check out a practitioner, read a blog, or go shopping. Take what you like, leave the rest, and createyourhealth.com.